Hello, in this video we're going to take a look at a real-world case that came to us from one of our valued customers. They had a question about how to use collision detection against fixture in Mastercam 2020. We were able to explain the process, which worked really well, so we thought we'd share it with everyone inside of our news update this month. First, I'm going to set up my stock. I'm going to use a stock model to do this. I'm going to select a solid model off my master cam screen. Next, I'm going to go into my simulator options and I'm going to set master cam to use that stock model for verification. And I'm going to set level 7 as my fixture. Let's take a look at operation number 10. It has a collision with my fixture. If I run simulation, I can now turn it on and off the visibility of my fixture. And when I run simulation, I collide, but nothing tells me that. I can turn on stop options to stop the simulation when there's a collision. I also need to go to my Verify tab and turn on Collision Checking. Also, in File Options, there are a few settings that can affect how Collision Checking works. Now, when I hit Play again, my simulation will stop because it found a collision with my fixture. I have to hit play multiple times to get through this collision, so I'm going to turn off my stop condition. And another way that I can look for collisions is to turn on my collision report. I can double click on the collisions in my collision report to move the tool to that collision. To fix this collision, I'm going to add the fixture as avoidance geometry in the toolpath. I'm going to tell it to stay 100 thou away from it. I'm going to run verification again, turning back on the stop condition for a collision, and now my simulation runs all the way through, no collisions in the report, no stops.